Hello and welcome. In this Grammar Bytes video, we're looking at to and enough. We use to, too much, or too many to say something is more than necessary. We put an adjective after to. This wardrobe is too small. I need a bigger one. The teapot is too hot. Don't touch it. This is too difficult. I have to stop. We use too many with countable nouns and too much with uncountable nouns. There are too many people here on this street. You put too much coffee in my cup. It's a mess. We can also use very to say something is positive or to make the meaning stronger. The weather is very beautiful in summer. Not just beautiful, but very beautiful. This baby is very cute. We use enough when we have the right amount of something and we can use it in different ways. We can use enough, then a noun, or we can use an adjective followed by enough. Let's look at some examples. Look, this car is big enough. The size of the car is the right amount. The adjective big is before the word enough. He replies, yes, we have enough money to buy it. It's cheap enough. The noun money is after enough. They have the right amount of money to buy the car. Do we have enough time to get it tomorrow? Sure. To say something is less than necessary, we can also use enough. This house is not big enough. They have a child now and they need more space. The young girl wants to swim, but her mum says, no, the sea is not warm enough. You can't swim. We use not, then the adjective, and enough. Not big enough, not warm enough. We can also use this with nouns. Of course, sometimes we may add an adjective to describe the noun that we use. Here are two examples. The exam is in an hour. I don't have enough blank paper. I didn't have enough sleep last night. We use not, then enough, followed by our noun. She did not have enough sleep. She does not have enough paper. Enough can be used with countable and uncountable nouns. Don't worry, we have enough chairs for everyone. And I will give you enough time to finish your essays. After to and enough, we often add the person by using a noun or a pronoun. There is enough fish for everyone. The noun fish is after enough and we add for everyone at the end of the sentence. Curry is too spicy for Sarah. The adjective spicy is after too and again we have added the person at the end of the sentence. Maybe curry is okay for you but it's too spicy for Sarah. There are too many formulas for me to understand. Maybe Einstein would be okay, but there are too many for me. I'm terrible at maths. Now it's your turn. Click on the link below for extra practice. Have a great day.